Hey. What's good, Faithor Army? So, this is a breaking news story. Um, I heard about this before, but then Sister in Christ's channel spoke on it. And so I just wanted to, she, she left a link to the story, and I will leave a link to her channel in case you want to check out her stuff, and um, she does great work. Breaking news, U.S. news, SWAT crisis, let me speak up, SWAT crisis, Colleyville Synagogue worshippers held hostage on live stream after man storms temple during service near Fort Worth. January 15th, 2022. What's that? I don't know what that noise was. Synagogue worshippers are reportedly being held hostage during a service that was being live streamed after a man stormed the temple near Fort Worth. SWAT teams and the FBI are responding to the situation at Congregation Beth Israel Synagogue in Colleyville, Texas. The, sus the suspect is claiming to be armed and says he is the brother of Efia Siddiqui, who was convicted in New, York, in New York of trying to kill U.S. military personnel, according to ABC correspondent Aaron Katersky. Efia Siddiqui, who has one brother, Muhammad Siddiqui, they love that name, don't they, is serving an 86-year sentence at at a prison near Fort Worth, Cater Sky reports. The suspect had reportedly been demanding to speak with his sister on the phone. A man's voice was heard talking on the live stream, which had since been ended, occasionally saying, quote, do something, unquote, and, quote, I haven't spoken to her, unquote, and at times yelling profanities. He was also allegedly heard saying, quote, I am going to die. Do not cry for me, unquote. According to CBS 11's nice number, Doug Dunbar. The man also made mention of having, quote, six beautiful kids, another number, unquote. No one, no one was seen on camera through the live stream. Only voices were heard. It is believed that four hostage, hostages, including a rabbi, are in the synagogue, but no in injuries have been reported, according to CNN. <laughs> CNN, great news source there. Congregation Beth Israel is located at 6100, another six, and a Pleasant Run Road in Colleyville, Texas. An evacuation is underway for residents in the immediate surrounding area. Colleyville police tweeted alerting residents of, of the situation. And it shows their tweets. You can pause if you want to read, of course, if you can see it. If it's not blurry, I'm sorry if it is. Colleyville Police, we are currently conducting SWAT operations around the 6100 block of Pleasant Run Road. All residents in the immediate area are being evacuated. Please avoid the era, area. Excuse me. They then tweeted that they will continue to offer updates via social media. The synagogue's morning service began around 10 a.m., According to their calendar, many have taken to Twitter offering thoughts and prayers to Rabbi Charlie Citron Dash Walker. It is unclear if he was leading the service, but according to the synagogue's website, Citron Dash Walker is their first full time rabbi. Police are stationed around the synagogue, and the FBI, you can always trust them, is working to negotiate with the suspect. Now, this is not to downplay any victims. I'm sorry for my sarcastic comments. But you, you have to look at their numbers, their names. This doesn't mean I don't pray for the for anyone that's harmed or hurt or, you know. But you have to look at their stuff. Just, is this real? Is this set up? I don't know. We'll know more later, probably, as we always do. Just look at Handy Sook. Police are stationed around the synagogue, and the F FBI is working to negotiate with with a suspect to de-escalate the situation. The White House is also aware of the situation. Collier Hill Police also told CNN there is no threat to the general public at this time, but are asking people to avoid the area. 
So that's breaking news. And um, she linked it as the U.S. Sun. I will leave a link to Sister in Christ's channel if you want to hear what she has to say. Or um, I, she's she's just she's the one who told me about the story. So um, I will leave a link to her channel. She does good stuff too. So all right, I'm out. God bless.